what's up guys how are ya how are you all doing welcome 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 to esiwakago youtube channel and this is where we inspire we inform and we also encourage people and today it's on wednesday and i am heading to my job yes i know you are wondering i you don't look like you're going to work yes i'm going to work and in fact i am going to clean mm? i am going to clean but today i woke up with the spirit of uh let me make up myself a little bit let me just uh touch touch my face i did some lipstick and i did some edges and i tried to draw my eyebrows don't worry they don't look like it but i tried i usually tell you people the day i will be able to draw my eyebrows and they will be very very professional my friend my friend hey even the blind will see mm? Mm? so i am going to my job today i only had one job so i didn't have to go there very early and guess what i have an entire bag of empty egg trays empty egg trays because i am going to i am going to pick up like 10 trays of eggs and since the girl who sells them to me uh, is a young lady who is in college or she is in high school i cannot remember i want to take the empty trays back so that she doesn't have to buy um no ones so that she can make maximum profit i'm a businesswoman you know so i know i know how to make things or to slimline the the expenses hmm? so today she's gonna be giving me like 10 trays of eggs dozens of eggs hmm. 10 dozens of eggs and since she is giving me with a good price I just want to save her some dollars uh, from buying the trays that is why I am carrying them so uh, I am going to the farms I'm gonna be driving to the farms a different direction last week a day like today I had a very very busy day I had three jobs different directions but I had some help I had some help um, so I went to the same house that I'm gonna be going today because it is every week service but to the other two that I was doing last week they are every other week so we're gonna be driving there and as we drive there I wanted to go with you so that um, I can show you today I should show you if I work just one house and um, this house has dogs by the way it has three dogs and it's a uh, every week service people ask me how much will I earn or how much did you make from that house for that much time i'm like cleaning has so many factors that direct the churches for example if a house has dogs if it, it has like five people living there like the number of people is a factor the number of dogs is a factor whether it has animals or doesn't have is a factor the frequency is a factor and also the usual mess people mess up their homes differently there are people who are gonna keep their home dirty up until a cleaner shows up there are people who cleans up after like they maintain their house after they mess that's a different case so my answer is you cannot go by the same price to every house 
simply because it has the same number of people it has the same number of dogs it, it has the the, the, the frequency is the same um, it depends it highly depends with the mess also if a customer I call them clients because they are not customers they are clients because you contract with them they don't uh, they, 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 they don't like um, they don't they don't hold like full rights like the customers do so if a, a, a client needs services frequently twice a week or once a week you need to be a little bit a little bit reasonable because this is someone who is every week meaning they are giving you income every week by weekly they are giving you weekly income so when you're charging them you won't charge them the same as a person who is bi-weekly with the bi-weekly you will have to have a difference of like that dollars or fifty dollars a difference because the, the weekly is more regular than that bi-weekly the monthly also has to have a difference of thirty dollars up the reason as to why i don't talk of actual figures is because there is no amount that is fixed to certain house from one to the other because of the factors i spoke about so guys let's drive to the home and i'll show you how long it takes me to be there and probably i might be able to tell you how much it will be at the end of the cleaning but mind you this is a home i clean every week so the rates are somehow i am somehow very much reasonable with them because it's every week so let's drive there guys homes hmm? 
after this roundabout I'm gonna be like on 15 I mean like 10 minutes or 5 minutes and I will get to where I am going the good thing about America they have roads they have built roads even in the interiors that's a school there I don't know if you can be able to see it because my camera is not heading the true north so all this you see they are homes that keep carols goats and um, whenever you see a fence a wooden fence it means they have they either have some carols or they have some some horses and donkeys It is a firm house trust me it's a firm house and they have um, they have they have a very huge firm at the back and as you can see this is a gas tank that is one significant that a, f a house is in the firms they don't have piped gas they have this type of gas so that tells you clearly we have arrived at the farms so let me get my stuff out i'm gonna back a little bit and uh, i will head in
so i am here and i am gonna start i am here and i'm gonna start cleaning i am more than ready
girl sells me drugs here. So that's when I come. bedroom, the basement, and the second living room. And they also have a hallway. Hallway bathroom. And the rest of the rooms are not cleaned. It's a how many rooms? One, two, three. Three bedrooms upstairs. And uh, is it how many down there? one and the basement yeah so i don't clean all of them i only clean one bedroom the second one is for vacuuming and they don't let me clean for the kids because they want them to clean their own rooms that is how things are done here so i'm gonna be driving back home and see you when you see me thank you so much for staying with me I know you're wondering how much I made and um, for the three and a half hours I made like a hundred and fifty dollars so now you know bye bye guys see you next